and boost Jonathan's behind the camera today oh, oh, oh yeah uh, it's been a while uh, I'm in the process of moving or waiting for my house to finish get being built so we got some other footage just kind of just hanging out until we get moved so we can get everything set up but uh my birthday was last week my wife is amazing and she bought me the extreme online store carbon front lip and carbon side splitters I guess is the best thing to call them all right let me show it to them real yeah. quick y'all all right so if you look right here this is real carbon fiber here's your front lip I haven't dealt a whole lot with carbon fiber parts like this, but this appears to be pretty good quality. So what I can tell, if you look right here, it seems like I've heard a lot of times people do like fiberglass and then overlay it with carbon fiber. But I mean, you can see right here, I don't believe that's the case. So pretty cool stuff. So I've been looking at them for a while now. Uh, it's kind of been on the list of things. A lot of other companies make great ones, either between steel, aluminum, or also uh, just fiberglass in general. Uh, but for a long time, I always just wanted to put some carbon fiber on. I don't want to go nuts and go all over. I just wanted something clean. And uh, I honestly haven't seen too many people run it. I know one of you guys on our Instagram, you guys have it. And I was able to ask you some questions. Everything fit great for you, didn't have any issues. So it was good to hear, it was good enough to know. And um, Thankfully, I just randomly mentioned it to my wife at one point, and the next thing I know, it was arriving at my house. So, super thankful for that. For Disclaimer, uh, his lovely wife called me and said, hey, what does Kyle want for his birthday? Yeah. I said, how about some carbon fiber? Yeah, there you go. So, so, all we're doing right now is we're going underneath the side skirt as it is. Honestly, my car was clean about two days ago, but then it's fallen to flood the past couple of weeks. For those of you that aren't from the country like we are, that just means it's rained a whole, whole lot. So. There's mud everywhere, uh, so right now there's just dirt and mud caked underneath the side skirt. Going to clean that off first with just some quick BK detailer. Uh, also have some alcohol we're going to come and spray on after that and clean it up just to make sure we get everything we need to so the adhesive sticks to it. All right, well, let's go ahead and get this thing started, Kyle. Let's do it. Oh, yeah. talking. Don't talk about it. Be about it. What's the thing, Samuel? Yes. Cool. All right, what's up, guys? So, um, real quick, this is probably the biggest part for this whole install. Um, this, what do you need to make this thing work? So, just uh, just as a, a thing that I did last night, I knew we were going to install these. So, I started looking on the internet of, you know, how do you how do you do it? Because I asked Kyle, and Kyle said it, this kit came with uh, no components to it and no instructions. So, I searched for probably two or three hours, and I know. Uh, the company makes a lot of things for Corvettes and things like that, but um, you don't see anything as far as Focus ST. So uh, we've done some trial and error ourselves. We've already completed one side just behind the scenes, so that way we can get a good idea. Um, is this the best way we're doing it? I don't know, but it seems like it's working pretty well. So what we're doing is, is we're cleaning the, the side skirt area, and then we're going back and using alcohol to clean and get, get any contaminants or whatever off of it. Once we get that cleaned up, we've got some 3M tape. So we're running some 3M tape. We're putting it on the actual um, side skirt itself, putting it where we want it to be. We're using a, a, my wife's hair dryer to heat it up so that way we can make it bond a little better. But once we get the double sided tape up there, we come over to the skirt, or in this case, we'll also do the, the front uh, lip spoiler. We're gonna run some alcohol across that just to make sure everything's clean for that. We use the tape, we're gonna put it in place, and then we're gonna use some, uh, what is this, three quarter inch self-tapping screws. Um, so that's it, that's what you need. My promises, you know I'm too generous. Now I've learned to never help you out. Cause I'm done cleaning up your mess. Found myself in my room. Kyle, look here. Can you explain to me where we're at? Well, we're at Jonathan's house with his great hair dryer. Keep our hair blowing in the wind. Shout out to Jay. Yep, letting us use it. Um, side skirt, we're gonna do everything online just using like self-tapping screws or in come back off. I've seen one guy take it off, use it with actually bolts, bolts and nuts to screw it in. We're gonna do self-tapping uh, screws and then double side the tape. Um, we've got some really nice, the extra strength molding tape, 3M, but 
but the key is to heat it up before you apply it so it actually gets everything activated so it sticks really well. So we're just going to do sections of it down on the body first. We've already lined it up, everything lines up great. Um, we have a good idea of how we want everything to fit. So we're just going to start doing the tape first and apply it. So that way, whenever we stick the side screw up, it'll be good to go. So that's what we're doing now. Let's go. What you doing, Kyle? I don't know if you can hear it, but they've got the double-sided tape mounted on the car. They went this route um, instead of mounting to the side skirts. So that's mounted. They're taking the red little cover off, and it's about to be go time. It's got its drawbacks as well. <laughs> Every time we've stuck something, had to unstick it. It's, it's been a pain. So what you think so far? I think that the front lip is probably taking us longer than both the side skirts. But we're just trying to get it exactly lined up, exactly where we want it before we put some screws in it. And it looks amazing already. So I think Kyle's gonna be really happy with it. Good deal. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to get. Oh. Right so right now we've got a <laughs> bit of danger. We want to make sure while he screws through that it doesn't go all the way through. So your your live action. Oh, stop! Stop! Yep. Okay. Success. satisfied everything fit perfect we didn't really have any issues going into this it is off of extreme online or wait extreme online store I think that's what we said yep um that's the company that offers these uh the front lip by itself is like 289 and then the side skirts together is 289 honestly it's not a bad deal because honestly you go look anywhere else and some of the plastic ones are going to cost you roughly around the same price i'll be honest looking online i couldn't find many reviews for these you had like one or two reviews on the actual website but at youtube you can't find anything anywhere online there's just not a lot of conversation i know more people have installed them than that but um it does make you a little weary sometimes when you can't get tons of people talking about something but 
Uh, we got it. We lined everything up. Like I said, we did do some double-sided tape, but honestly, that was just a little bit more of a safety procedure just to keep something there in addition to the screws. Uh, we did talk on the front lip. At some point, we may come back and just actually change it out with like some nuts and bolts to make sure nothing's going to go anywhere. But everything's very sturdy right now. Everything's holding on well. No issues. Doesn't like we're going to have any issues. But uh, yeah, carbon fiber is a great product. Everything looks great. There wasn't any flaws in the actual carbon fiber weave. Everything looked really good. And uh, the company itself does stand by their product. It says that, you know, if you're not satisfied with the fitment or anything else, send it back. Uh, they definitely stand by that, at least the way it appears. I don't know, I didn't have to send it back. I was really satisfied with everything. But uh, that's it. The only thing I wish they did was the rear splats or spitters or splitters, splats, that's whatever. We'll edit that out, I guess, I don't know. For the rear pieces, they don't offer a rear lip in the carbon fiber, but uh, we're gonna look at some different options coming up for that too. But overall, super satisfied. It makes the car just look so much better now um, with it installed. So definitely check it out if you're looking for a great quality carbon fiber lip and side skirts for your ST. Uh, and I think they offer some other products, tons of other stuff like Corvettes and Camaros and tons of other vehicles, but definitely reach out to them and check this out for yourself. I think you'll be satisfied. Yeah, I can speak uh for myself i guess but this thing it came out amazing you know i it's not that i was skeptical i saw the parts i ceramic coated the parts um it, it's it's great quality parts but i was just trying to make sure you know i couldn't completely see the vision on how it goes together but let me tell you what this thing is fire son this uh the weave like right now in this light is popping off you can see it is it, and, and it like kyle said i mean it finishes the car and I, uh, you know, I, I never noticed it. I mean, the, the factory body kit looks great, but now, at least with Kyle set up, lowered wheels, you know, all the stuff he's got done to it, this kind of touches everything off. Um, so I can recommend it for sure. Um, and the main thing is, you know, like I, I had mentioned earlier, there was not a lot of information out there. Um, we kind of showed you what we did. Everything looks like it's secured well. Um, I stand by what we did. So. Uh, maybe this will help you out uh, whenever you go to do yours, but like I said, I highly recommend it. Stoppers fly mad, I'm like choppers, choppers. Better took those risks, cold blood on my fist. We fly as starters, starters. One of them will kill you, we'll reach those heights. Always get a feeling that I won't deny. Now what? Never can pass. Look at my eyes. I'm on the rotten surprise. So we got a lowered ST in the driveway of doom. Are we gonna rip this brand new front lip off? Huh? Uh-oh. Oh, you got plenty of room. You're good. I got us. I got him. Russell, what are you doing, son? What are you doing, babe? All right, so now we're gonna pull back in. Ooh, she closed. That is good. That was my biggest fear here is it's already hard to get in my driveway. But with this setup, no problem. Yeah. 